Hey everyone, welcome back to a new episode of Sim Airport. So, we last left off with three gates open. We have a lot of people in this airport, which it kind of makes me lag a little bit, but I think it's going to be alright if I do it on the second speed, not the, like, the super fast one. So I might have to just play with this, with the second speed on, but it seems to like everyone is working quite well. I might have to redo like these. I kind of want to make this a little bit bigger. Probably up to here like down there and then up again. But that's going to cost me so much money. So if I build. If we go to. Where's the foundation? Here, we, here it is. So if we do that, how much is that going to cost? $103,000. That's going to cost me a lot of money. And this makes me lag a little bit with everyone going to line and then just waiting there. But it is a big flight. I kind of want to make big flights over here now. And make the small ones go to this one. Not too sure if that's going to be good or not. But everyone seems to be going onto this flight. We have 50 minutes until that closes. We need, like, to change this out. Because drop off is kind of really close to the pickups. And then I'm not sure how I'm going to do that. I kind of need a direct route out of here. Because this kind of doesn't, doesn't look good at all. Because you go straight through security. Which I don't think that's going to be great. Okay, what can I actually do? Why is this a different colour anyway? I have no idea. But there's not many people coming in. Maybe because the flight schedule is scheduled to 4. So the last one's already gone. And then the next one's coming in at 4. So that's going to take a while. So we can actually fast forward that. $800 per takeoff and landing, so that's $1.6,000 per plane that takes off and lands. So that's going to be really nice. So it pretty much pays for one staff wage for an hour. So we could change up the pricing. $25 per person, yep, per passenger. I might make that $30. And we could actually make it a thousand dollars per landing and take off. It's going to cost me a lot of money if people start not wanting to be at the airport. Can I check all the statuses? Can I add more? Because I want to add more planes and see what the variety is. How do I even do that anymore? Here. Okay. Atlanta. We need one in the very morning. So, are you in the morning? You can't even accept any because we need the massive gate. What about you? We can't even accept any of you. What are you? 707. I want to get like A380s and all that. That would be awesome to do. We can get a 737. How many passengers? 140. In the afternoon. Maybe we could do that. Okay. There is so many people here. Wow. Two new flights just came in. How many people are on here? 191. And then 100. That's actually a lot. I kind of want to add more security but... It seems to be working fine. I want to fix up all the queues, but I need money. That's all I need. I need a lot of money. Maybe I'll just expand this part a little bit. Look how slow it's going. Shouldn't go that slow. So if we build a foundation add through here, that should start getting built. And then I will add the queues differently and all that. Make them a little bit bigger. 
all we'll have to do is wait for the builders to come and build this. We don't need any staff. We don't need... What are the reports? Secured areas. Yep, that's all good. Heat map. What is the heat map anyway? The toilets, maybe? Okay, the heat map is over here. A lot of people are here. Don't even know why. Yep, we need to hurry up and build this. Hopefully they take away these concretes and all that, but I think they will. Builders working at it, that's good. Get rid of that wall there. Really, is this wall going to stay here? Dismantle object and leaves indoor flooring. Yep, we need to get rid of that. So, we need to do queues again. How are we going to dismantle this one? How do we get rid of this queue? Can we get rid of it that way? Okay, there. I haven't played this in a while, so I'm getting used to it again. Okay, I need to start doing this queue. I made it a little bit bigger, so it's better for this stage. So do we start from the... Yes, we start from the beginning. So I want one not there. I want it one below that. So here. Go down. Cross. Just like this. And then go like this way. Nope, wrong way. I want it to go down along this wall. And I did it again. Probably going to mess up a lot. And just keep going like this. No, that's a new queue. I don't want a new one. Can we get rid of you? And then hopefully this changes up a lot more passengers. Nope. I could just leave it there. Yeah, I'm going to leave it there and see how many people actually use that. So if we assign that queue there. Is there two queues? I really hope not. I really hope there's not two queues there. Because that took me a while to do. Oh, there is two queues. It ends there. Oh no, that's going to be terrible. I'm going to leave that for now, but I'll assign it to them. I'll assign it to this queue and this one. It doesn't matter. I should have checked it to make sure. They should all be going into the queues now. This is only a small flight. Oh, we shouldn't really have this flight here. I might change it around. So, a uh, Smart Lux 8777 and Pacific Airlines. We need to change them around. So, schedule. What time is it? 9 o'clock. Yeah, we'll change this one to go to the gate 3. Yeah, you can come in early. I don't mind. Maybe just like that. And then we will change... No, the Pacific Airlines can go there. I might make it go into the second one. A Ford Air. Yeah, I'm changing all the times. I'm not really sure which time should go where. Because they're going to overlap a lot. So you can come in earlier, way earlier. And you'll be the last person. I think that could work. Hopefully that works. If it doesn't, I can always change it back. Because that new queue is way too big to do an airline with only 13 passengers. It needs to be a lot more. 
like a bigger airplane like 166 because I think these queues are a little bit too small it's 10 o'clock in the morning not many flights here is that one going as well? I think it is one person did not board I don't think or is one person yeah one person didn't board who didn't board their flight I have no idea there was a lot of people here I probably should change up the ticketing area so if we get rid of all the queues I want to get rid of them all and then redo it all so if we get rid of it all just get rid of the fast queue as well okay so I want to move all these so if we build let's clear all them hopefully the passengers all go to this here they may take a while to go through but we need to fix up the ticketing area so objects go to ticketing booth ticketing desk we will add one there yep one there two three and then we'll do probably on the other side we'll do one two three have two gaps in between one two wait should I do two or should I do one gap I'm gonna do one gap in between so there and then how many is this one two three four five in between one two three four five so here so we have an extra couple of ticketing desk hopefully that works yeah they're going through that some are going to lose their flight because of this but I will try to get it done as soon as possible we need utility conveyor line to add it onto these so can we actually get rid of use and we'll change this up a little bit actually you can stay there can't you so we'll one there go along this way into this one and then these hopefully they can join onto each other I really hope so if they can I don't know if they can add onto there because that's going hopefully they can add on to there I just hope they can and then let's do it onto that one yeah I really wish these could work I'm not sure if they can so if they start adding the conveyor belt to join which they are I'm not entirely sure if that's working it doesn't look like it actually it doesn't look like it so that is working hopefully they fix this unless they have to walk all the way around to actually fix it which they did that is working okay that's good and then the last one hopefully they do the last one well look at all the luggage that's actually a lot and look at it all pile onto here that's pretty cool okay now we need queues queues are very painful in here I need to actually delete that because I did not mean to put it there so why are they collecting the baggage I think they're collecting it because they can't go on to it not too sure why are you collecting it yeah I've no idea hopefully they get to their plane I'm not entirely sure if it's going to work properly I just really hope it works yeah they all going through 
Yeah. So we need utilities. Is this working? Conveyor belts. It looks like they are. Do I have to join them on? Maybe just like that. Does that make it work? Or is that already done? Because they look like they're putting it on. Are they putting it on now? They seem to be. It's functional. I did not mean to put that there. I may have to just demolish these. Yeah, I don't know if that's making it work or not. I really hope it is. Oh, it kind of looks like it is working. Wow, terminal usage $6,000 just for one aeroplane. And we have like 10 aeroplanes, which is awesome. We may need more ticketing kiosks for the faster check-ins if you don't have luggage. What are you worried about? Oh, because the wall is not there anymore. Not sure why. Let's put the wall back. That will definitely be able to stay up there. The zones. Oh, that's what we're meant to do. We were meant to make this into a new office. So let's put a wall there instead. Yeah. That's what you need to do. And then we can hire another person. That's what we're meant to be doing. And then we have to build a door. So do we have a door? I think it's in this one. Door. Yes, we do. Rotate. They can build that. It's going to be a small office. Desk goes there and then a chair office chair you can rotate and then you can go there hopefully that's working a lot now which person goes in this one office you need to do that we'll also make it like that oh we can't okay staff member we need a COO so you can stay there hopefully that works now what is the research that we need to be doing road building available 16,000 ability to build and demolish roads that could be awesome completed completed they're all completed schedule an extra double decker okay we'll definitely do this 16,000 and then we need them too and then we're done every research we need the queues on these ticketing desks because these fill up super fast yeah definitely need to do it so this one can be like first class maybe I think that would be the best option to do that's not giving me a lot of room is it I might have to bring out the ticketing a little bit so let's do that let's make it all this space because we're not really using it are we and then we need to I might start the queues up here so I'll start it kind of here. Oh, it doesn't give me a good space on the other side to actually start a queue. But I actually might do this. And then just make this a small queue here. Just like this. Actually, that doesn't need to go that far. So if we do it probably there. Let's make this a small one because this is actually going to be... A first class only and then this one can be anyone 
So we need to assign these to this queue. Assign, and then this one can be first class passengers. I can't even see the message. Okay, first class. Okay, that you can actually only do first class. Okay, coach only for this queue. Can I close everything? Is this the same for every queue? Yep, first class. Yep. And then we could assign it to this one for coach only if we need to. If uh, over populate in the coach only we'll have three extra deaths to actually do like more work than just these three if that makes sense assign it to that and then we'll have to do the same on this side so kind of wanting to do the same so if we start from here two three go down again and then back uh, should I go to the right or should I go to the left I might go to the left and just do that to have a little bit more Q and then the next one should go one down and just like that that one looks good. I like that. So if we do assign and assign, we need to assign these. Slow progress with the ticketing desk. Assign them. Assign these. Hopefully these don't queue up that much. So this queue can be first class only this one can be coach let's see how that goes and see if that actually works not many people are coming here so I can't really test it a lot of people are going to the first class only they're getting served so much more I may have to move this this is probably in the way, so if we dismantle this and then put more of them down. Uh, flight info, so if we put some... Can I like rotate them? Okay, let's put one there. One there. Let's put one there. We'll have to put some... I think we've already got some in here. Yeah, we've got them in between the benches and all that. So we may as well keep it there. So many people here. So I think that's going to be good for our queues. I will dezone the queues that we don't actually need up to here. Yeah, we'll do it up to there. Can we assign this to a queue? No, I really wish you could. So people can line up instead of just bunching up behind one each, one another. But I might leave this episode here. We have $116,000. We can slowly start affording a large gate. Oh, we can actually do that. 42000 I actually might build one right now. So if we come over here and then build a large gate, that's actually so big. So, should I put it here? I might put it down here somewhere. Or should I put it up here? That doesn't fit, okay. That plane taken off. Oh, landing, I'm not really sure. So I'm going to put it along here. So if we do... Let's just continue it along here. So if we make two of them, that's going to be really good for our airport. That's going to take a while to build, though. Hopefully they build it super fast. I think they will. So where the builders coming? Any of them going to arrive here? Yes, they are. Here they come. How long do they take to build? 
Okay, not that long. Okay, a large gate is going to be done just there. Oh no, I only just realised. How much to dismantle it? Because these are actually the wrong way round. I only just noticed that. Demolish this. Demolish cost. Blocked by pending construction. Oh no, really? Did that just cost me all my money? Okay, I might have to AFK a little bit before the next episode. So if we do here, that's the right way. 42,000. We lost pretty much 80,000 on that. But this is the right way, I think. It should be the right way. We are gaining a lot more money because I made it $30 per person in this airport to use it and 1,000 take off and land. So that's 2,000 each aeroplane. Okay, that's working now. Now we need a road, objects, road, taxiway, nope that's not the right one, taxiway, I might make it along here, oh that's costing a lot so I might just do that for now, I want to join it up to here to have another entrance, right click for pending construction. Hopefully we're able to accept A380s because that would bring in a lot of cash. It's going to be difficult to maintain it because we'll have to get more people on security and ticketing. Ticketing is not that bad at the moment. So what is this? Do you want to go away maybe? We may have to join it up, I'm not too sure. But I think we're able to accept them now. Yeah, we have an extra gate. Gate A4. Let's actually check, though, if we're able to. So, how many people want to join here? What airplane is it? It's these. Galactic Point. These are the big airplanes. A350, 360 passengers, A380, 525, 747, 525, and 300. I actually might accept a night flight for an A380. Morning flight for an A380 as well. Oh, this could be dangerous. I'm not sure how... I'm going to assign, actually I don't think I can do that yet, because I don't have a direct route to them. I might have to change this up, like make this one a separate little queue for now, but I might do that in the next episode. So I could actually just do like this one direct route to there and then just have one queue all the way down there and then one ticketing desk or two that could work but I'm gonna leave this episode here if you liked it leave a like subscribe and I will be back with a new episode in a few days thank you for watching